It's Weekend Update with Colin Jost and Michael Che. Good evening, everybody. Welcome to Weekend Update. I'm Michael Che. And I'm Colin Jost. <laughs> this weekend, bitter rivals who have been desperately pandering for votes and trying to force their politics on America will finally face off in person. I'm, of course, talking about tomorrow's Oscars. <laughs> <laughs> the Motion Picture Academy has rejected a request from Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky to make an appearance during the Oscars, but they promised that Volodymyr Zelensky will be how John Travolta pronounces Viola Davis. <laughs> Organizers of the Oscars said they changed the color of the arrival carpet from red to champagne so the mood would be more mellow. But I don't know, switching from red to champagne usually turns me into a full on bitch. <laughs> President Biden proposed his budget that would help fund Medicare with a 25% tax on billionaires. Ha! Take that, Rihanna. <laughs> <laughs> President Biden's proposed budget included $400 million to counter Chinese disinformation. It will target the number one source of Chinese disinformation, fortune cookies. <laughs> <Shut Tucker. up. laughs> Tucker Carlson, seen here laughing at a dog locked in a hot car. <laughs> Released security footage from the January 6th attacks with the violence edited out and said it proves it was a peaceful gathering, which is like editing all the sex out of a porn video and saying it's a short film about being a stepmom. New documents from the Dominion lawsuit reveal texts from Tucker Carlson in which he says he hates Donald Trump passionately and can't wait until he's able to ignore him. That must suck to go on TV and put on a smile and make friends with some psychotic bigot just because it's good for the show. <laughs> anyway, back to you, Colin. <laughs> no, I don't get it. RuPaul, RuPaul harshly criticized lawmakers who support banning drag shows, calling them stunt queen politicians. And let me just say, Hallelujah, girl. I, you know, I got to serve realness on this one. These, these dusty breeders are resting on ugly, and I am gagging on it. And I'm sorry, guys, before the show, I switched from red to champagne. <laughs> Oh, boy. President Biden said that he supports a bill that would allow the government to ban TikTok, but only because Biden thinks TikTok is a gang member from his old neighborhood. <laughs> After Walgreens announced that they will stop selling abortion pills in 21 states, CVS has remained silent on the issue, while over at Rite Aid, you can just grab a pill from the Take Abortion, Leave Abortion <laughs> program. It was reported that the organizers of King Charles's coronation have officially invited Meghan Markle, and this is nice, at a starting salary of $19 an hour. <laughs> I thought, that seems very generous, guys. Yeah. 